Om Shanti. We have been recording for the past couple of days. We have missed out actually four days. So we are recording from 20th of January's Godly Blessing. So here Supreme Father says in this blessing, May you experience being full of imperishable attainments. Perishable attainments are everything which you see around you with your eyes, which you touch, which you feel. Those are perishable attainments. From God and remain happy hearted. So at the confluence age, you receive direct attainments from God. What is indirect then? During our years or let's say during our previous time or previous births, we have been doing a lot of devotion. That is an indirect connection with God. But now we are talking about direct connection with God because God himself introduces himself when he comes down on earth and he introduces us also in our rightful form, which we have forgotten. So at the confluence stage, that means there's a confluence between souls and supreme soul. We, human beings and supreme being. So at the confluence stage, you receive direct attainments from God. Compared to the present time, the future is nothing. So future is golden age. Future is deitism. We become deities. But now we are Brahmins. We are from Brahmin to become deities. It takes time. It takes a lot of hard work. So God says during this time, you are in connection with me. But when you become a deity in the golden age, after the end of Kali Yuga, that time you forget me. You forget how did you become a deity. You forget Kali Yuga because you've already gone up to Param Dham and then you return down. So your memory is almost merged, not washed, merged. So you forget it. So this is the time when you are there with me. It's the most precious time, the present time. It has got no comparison with the future. That is a golden age. So your song is, I have attained what I wanted to attain. We have attained God means godly knowledge, God's secrets, God's design of this complete creation, everything we have obtained. The song of the present time is nothing is lacking in the treasure of treasure stores of Brahmins. So the treasure stores of Brahmins are breath that keeps on increasing when we meditate. That means our health becomes better. Then is our time. Our time on earth improves, becomes longer as you meditate. We are in this body. So time is also very precious. Connection with God is very precious. Powers, virtues, knowledge and many more things. So these are the treasures which we attain from Godfather as compared to the physical treasures. These attainments are imperishable. Time imperishable. Breath imperishable. Knowledge imperishable. Power imperishable. Virtues are also imperishable. Remain full of these attainments and the speciality of happiness will constantly be visible in your activities and on your face. But if we think about physical attainments and we start comparing ourselves with others, obviously we will become sad. But when we think about these imperishable attainments from God, then the comparison of the worldly things reduces and we are more focused on the spiritual things. So remain full of these attainments and the speciality of happiness will constantly be visible in your activities and on your face. No matter what happens, those who have all attainments can never let go of their happiness. Can never let go of their happiness, which is permanent happiness or which is imperishable happiness as compared to the perishable happiness. To learn more about the differences between the perishable and imperishable happiness and how do we attain it from the Supreme Creator and how come it is a confidence age which is going on, do visit a Brahma Kumai Center nearby you. Om Shanti.